Yeah. Why would one schism? Why would one take any notice of politics in Britain? I'm sure it's the same in America. All that matters is the following. Now, the weather fork, the, it's been here, it's been incredible weather for two weeks. No, the weather is just the weather. It has been overcast and totally grey. Not cold, but just totally grey. And then, yesterday, the sun came out. And the forecast is very, very clear. Yesterday sunny, today sunny. I actually planned my week around... Now, I feel like I'm 18 most of the time. But, if you want to be healthy, the sun's here. I've arranged to do my shopping somewhere up there. And doing a little bit of writing, etc. here. Good for me. Your people in charge, be they the bureaucrats who will decide on where the money goes in the NHS, the bureaucrats who decide where £10 billion, 10 .1, I was wrong, owned by the Church of England, which is way up in the last three or four years. Behind me is an old people's home in a very nice place. A chap was wheeled past me ten minutes ago. Quite reasonable looking, actually. Uh, reasonable, must have been a good 80, but um, in a wheelchair. And I actually said nicely, Hey, if it were me, I'd linger out here for half an hour and get some sunshine the wheeler of the wheelchair looks at you like you're some insane person. Now, they're the insane ones, as are the bureaucrats, those who consider themselves medical people, etc. Those who control the money. I mean, if I was in charge of health in Britain, I'd actually, just quite simply, make sure they all check into the weather forecast every morning, and each patient. They shouldn't be patients. They should just be people who get more problems, health problems as they get older. It has got to be wheeled outside. This is a sun trap. It has got to be wheeled outside for five hours a week. Full stop. End of. That's how you care for them and that's how you that's not why I turned the camera on. I mean, it's just pointless. But this country is literally mad. Anyway, the most interesting thing. God, yesterday I was enjoying it. I was doing a really hard work, physical job. And I was pondering. So, I think I put a film up. I've got so many bits of films to put up, which I'm going to now. <laughs> and it looks like i got a new laptop coming. Because my old laptop is... So, but my old, anyway, I'm not going to bother. <sighs> and that would be a miracle. Yeah, I put a little film up, but I'm going to actually, i got to take off any identification and just put a copy of a message because it saves me time. My laptop is so rickety and old. I sent a message, yeah, saying the night before the American elections, saying, I've changed my mind. Yes, most of the more thoughtful people are really considering, let's call it, in fact it was a protest vote against the bizarre Teletubbyitis that took over the, well they're not left, they're just using, they're, they're performing that they care to emotionally blackmail people and it's going to carry on in Britain a lot more now. Ooh, we're all the victim of the orange one now. But anyway, I sent a message out saying, yeah, do you know what, I've thought about this. I was sure that if I were, had to vote in America, I would <laughs> abstain, but not really, okay, vote for a shake-up. But I'm actually, no. It's got to be a woman. It's got to be a woman. Even if it were 
Demelza from 101. Is it Demelza? From 101 Dalm Dalmatians? Vote for her. The system has got checks and balances around. And somebody. It's crystal clear. I disagree. I don't want it to be any woman. I want it to be a decent woman. By yesterday, inside of me, it was bubbling around. God, she's right. I hope that message gets out. That's, we've got hope when younger women can be thinking right now. Despite working in the most woke world in the world, and knowing that the woke has to stop. Anyway, that's not why I turned the camera on. Yeah, so Agent Z, God, sends me in a tweet this morning. <laughs> yeah. It just proves, because I actually, no, there's nothing worse. My whole generation, just utterly, it became fashionable 25, 30 years ago to sort of say, oh, I'm just so disconnected from politics and I don't listen to the news. This is not true. So many of them, the ones who really say that, they are actually monitoring things and they're monitoring things merely for, for things to say that make them look good. Is that what I'd realised before, about half an hour ago, which is why I turned the camera on? Yeah, it kind of is. Oh, particularly my brown ex-friend, Jesus Christ. Yeah, that's what they've been doing. When two things that went between myself and Agent Z this morning, they just sum it all up. Hey, you've got to be involved in the fight. The fight is dirty. It's really dirty. It's horrible. It's a waste of time. But if you get involved in the fight and just make one small change, that's all that can actually happen. Is that why I turned the camera on? I turned the camera on to say, do come back. Since it was April, uh, August. There's me, the end of July, saying to myself, oh, I always hate August. Nothing good ever happens in August, ever. It's horrible. It's just for gobby, what do you call them? Gobby, gobby, gobby. Well, down here they have their silly word, Emmets now. Gobby, um, grockles. I was completely wrong. I had the best August I've had for many years. <laughs> but. If anybody had known, knows what I've done, you see, despite the following being connected to an actually famous public figure, I bet she hasn't got anybody else who's telling her like a friend should. What's been back and forth between me and a public of well-known, well, not that well-known, but well-ish known, woman public figure. The correct word is goading, but that's the point. You see, if you live properly, now I feel good because I've had some sunshine, although I got up far, far too early this morning. I'm going to go and have a nap now because I've timed it. The clouds are coming over now. Go and have a nap and then get a second wind. But if you've organised your life such that it is so simple, you need virtually nothing, then when really interesting moments come totally out of the blue, and a little hook you send out, or in my case, thrust out and jab in her bottom, as she knows I've been doing for a year, you've got the time, the space, and the energy not to apply yourself, it's different. It's if you're in the right space and unconcerned, nothing dragging you down. I have nothing, zero, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> the 
if you're in that right space, something comes along, you could be Donald Trump and have fantastic quick intelligence aged 78. Now I shouldn't have said DT there, I should have said, I can have said thousands of other people. But it all comes down to non, not causes that are not overwhelming, which is what I uh, said to her with her astrology. I don't do them. I've given them up. But this one is just the ultimate, and it truly should be total. It, it'll be better than Monty Python. And the crazy thing is, she should. She should. <laughs> we shall see.